Anthony and Alex directed the 1980s. They push so many boundaries visually and the way that they shot their interviews, the way that they did everything, they just had such a keen and heightened way of visually storytelling that was just so relevant, so beautiful, and, and deeply impactful. I remember the 80s with both anger and despair and joy. You can't have an episode in the 80s in a historical document about LGBTQ rights without talking about AIDS. And it does, and it talks about ACT UP and of various people who were involved. We are angry at the way this city has handled this crisis, and we demand that Ed Koch exert leadership and declare a state of emergency. It's a decade where there was a lot of lives lost, and so there was an immense amount of pain and suffering. We also wanted to profile and look at some of the positive things that were happening. There was an explosive arts movement, you know, in the 1980s. Also, we began to see the role of the family uh, being created and uh, chosen families. It's, you know, your family and who you feel supported and loved by, especially with the black trans movement of today and the emphasis that we finally are putting on those folks. I think that you can kind of see it start to form in a real big way in the 1980s. We have always bonded against oppression. It's about rallying together and fighting the people trying to push you down.